Hello everyone and welcome back to Baking with Kat. Today I'm going to be doing a peach floral cake. So if you'd like to see how I do that, stay tuned. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified when I upload new videos. All right, let's go. So as you can see, I'm just starting off with my classic American buttercream. time to assemble the cake that my customer ordered was a vanilla cake and a raspberry filling so I'm going to assemble and crumb coat Now that I'm all done crumb coating the bottom tier, I'm going to place it in the fridge for about 15-20 minutes and work on the top tier. The top tier is vanilla with raspberry filling. All done with the top tier, gonna place that in the fridge and work on the frosting for the bottom tier. The bottom tier is a three tone peach color. So as you can see, I'm just comparing the flowers that I bought to the color, which is still very orange. So I am going to add in some yellow to see if I can tone it down.
right, so I have got all three colors for the bottom tier. There's my dark, my medium, and my light one. I'm going to put them in some piping bags and get to piping.
So I think this is the most nerve-wracking part for any baker is stacking the cake. As you can see, I am like super hesitant on if I dropped it correctly, if it was too far back, uh, but it worked out perfectly as you can see. Now I'm just placing a straw in the middle of the cake and to stabilize it so it doesn't move. And then I am going to put the flowers and cake topper on. just to add the final touches I'm putting a ribbon a gold ribbon on the bottom of the cake board and then going to add my last couple flowers Again, thank you so much for watching. I loved how this cake turned out. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified when I upload new videos. Right now, I'm uploading weekly. Until next time, bye.